So this video is intended to show my colleagues and uh, their students and my students how to install Abacus and associated programs from the tar files that are downloaded. All right, so this should be the directory structure that I've given to you through UA Box. You need to install 7-zip to take care of the tar files. Here's the Abacus installation and licensing guide. What we're going to do is basically go to section 2.1 and learn how to install the, the software. Okay, so we'll be following through here. I've extracted this file from the distribution already uh, so that you can have it handy to take a look at it. But here's what we're going to do. Um, we're going to go into this uh, folder that I made, and we see all these different tar files. After you install 7-zip, you're going to extract into various folders one folder for each of these files. There's a one through five, and then there's a documentation tar file, and then there's a zip file here. All right, so we're just uh, extracting these each to their own folder. In a moment, we're gonna combine these folders. This is a little bit different than what I've done in the past. I've extracted out the the Windows code and put them in their own folder for everybody. But uh, some people have been using Linux more lately. So I want to give you uh, everything that's available to us. And additionally, there's some extended products, which includes a uh, optimization package and a finite element-based uh, fatigue calculator that they have, FE-safe. You know, you can also extract the zip file. I'm not going to do it here, but it, it contains some additional information on the various products. All right. So we're going to make a folder called unload. And we're simply going to copy the contents of each of those folders, one through five, into the unload folder. Okay, we're going to go in here, going to select these. I'm just going to cut and paste it into here. Go ahead and merge the folders. Uh, we could have extracted them to the same directory. That's fine, too. Let's see. I think I'm on four. And now five. All right, so we should have the contents of all those one through five extended all OS into the unload folder. All right, now here's what you need to do first. You need to first go into the documentation folder. Okay, here's the documentation for Abacus and FE Safe. 
going to go in here and then install this through the setup. You need to install the documentation first. Okay, if you want to do FE safe, uh, here's the licensing guide. Uh, and you can read the README files through here. If you want to install iSight and Tasca documentation, uh, you go through here. Okay, so install that documentation first. Next, you go into the unload directory. Okay. Here's uh, Abacus CAE. Now you have your choice, Linux and Windows. And then you start the setup. When you do the setup in here, you select a product install. I maintain the license server, so you don't need to worry about that. Select a product install. And then you will need to point it to the license server that's specified in my readme file that would be in here. Uh, in this readme file will be the list of faculty who have purchased licenses and uh, tokens for Abacus and uh, the the IP address or the license server name. Okay, so that's what we need to do. 